He's my father. He's the flesh and blood part of who I am. I just need to see him. I need to look into his eyes and know who he is. You say I'm nothing like him. Okay, well, let me see for myself. I don't expect him to love me, to care about me or even like me. I certainly don't expect him to become a part of my life. I just need to know if he's willing to acknowledge me. And if he's not, I'm going to have to be okay with that. Everything's always been about you, never about me. I knew you were going to kill Barry, but you didn't even care. You didn't give a damn about what it would do to me. Look, I'll say whatever Susan wants me to say, but I've got to get out of here. No, no, no. You don't just get to walk away from me. I made you. You're in my blood. You don't go anywhere until I let you go. Then let me go. You look at me and you don't like what you see. But this is the price, Mother. The price of belonging to you. If I could, I would take it all back. I would. Then tell me you don't want me to testify. Tell me you don't want me to like this. Tell me you would sacrifice the rest of your life to have me back the way I was. Listen, forget it. A deal's a deal, just leave it at that. Leave. You are so unbelievable. Darlene is my best friend. I know her better than anyone. She wouldn't waste her time with a loser. Why would she care? Because she believes in you, Ronnie. She doesn't think you're a loser. She's never been so happy since you were around. She loves you. She needs you and she can't do this alone. If you don't go back to her, then you are a loser. How can I be a father? How can I be a husband? I can't. I just can't. Ugh. Can't, 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 can't. That's the problem, Ronnie. There's never an I can.